High school has been on their minds for some time, and they were already looking into making some changes before a lockdown in February. But after a student called in a gun sighting last month, officials say adding to secure, current security measures became even more urgent. Currently, we don't have really any security at, at Charleston High School. Uh, it's really kind of a throwback to the 1970s. Uh, as you well know, you can walk and enter any, any uh, uh, door. And that is why officials say making changes is... Money well spent. Faculty members say they believe the high school is safe now, but finding ways to improve is always a good idea. I feel that Charleston High School is a very safe place. These are things that we're looking at that possibly make things better. Parents say finding the right answer to do that isn't an easy one. If I say, uh, yeah, they should be spending this on books and computers and technology and at the high school, and then they, somebody gets shot next week, then I, I answered wrong. And I'm sure that's kind of the catch-22. So the school district is moving forward with changes like adding security cameras throughout the school, changing outside doors to shut, and lock with a magnetic system, and purchasing four metal detector wands to aid in searching students in the event of another threat. But all those changes didn't come just because of a threat last month. We had looked at all these things prior to the incident that we had. There may have been some skepticism out there about us doing these types of things. Uh, since that particular gun scare, uh, I'm seeing le less resistance. And school officials say everyone will benefit in the event of another incident. Not that Charleston High School is not a safe place to be, but uh, in this day and age, you're always looking at things that can uh, you can do better. Will I feel better? Probably. Do I also feel like it shouldn't have to be this way? Yeah. Superintendent Little.